Never sit to ain't passing the ditch to defy. I know this not a challenger. Big one. I keep some members with me in the breach. Get coke, see, they some cannibals. Eaters. They like the geek geek. Drink a whole bottle, wake up and repeat. Damn. She took a look, missing with the chill out. Now she says she's in 3D. Wow. I go in the jungle and I got a coat. I bet I come out with a me. Do this I... for the fam, cause it's bigger than me. Web, got it. Web, got it. Hello guys, welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber, it's Jada, and today I have a feminine hygiene routine for you guys, so starting off I'm just gonna light a candle to have the bathroom smelling good, it took me two times to light this because I don't have a lighter, and this candle is from Bath and Body Works in the scent Pink Watermelon, and it smells so good. So here is all the products that I will be using in this video today. I can't be pale in my casket, make sure I die with a tan, it's part of the brand I know that I came with a slide from left to right, but now I don't wanna dance Can't I depend on a man, I slide some bread in the jam, that's just who I am Custom just waving at us from the window, they can't even come from so before I actually started my shower, I went in with the Skin Fix Glycolic Renewing Scrub. You could use it as a pre-shower. It has 7% glycolic acid and 6% lactic acid. And I just dry rubbed this all over my skin. And honestly, I got the best results dry rubbing this than going in with this on wet skin like I usually do. I made sure to get all my problem areas like my shoulders and my back because I have blemishes there. After that, I went ahead and rinsed it off, and this is where my shower actually began. I used the Dove body wash in the scent Cucumber and Green Tea. Um, it smells really good. It's not my favorite scent, but I really want to try the antibacterial one because I've heard a lot about that. But this soap does suds up a lot, as you are going to see in the following clip. I scrubbed that into my skin, making sure to get everywhere, my neck, my shoulders, my back, my legs, and my armpits. I didn't get my armpits on camera because I forgot, but in the middle of my shower, I was like, wait. I didn't even wash my armpits, so I went back and washed my armpits, so don't be alarmed that you guys don't see that on camera. For my back, I went in with my other loofah, uh, it's on a stick, so I'm just gonna call it loofah on a stick, um, and I went and I got my back because I couldn't reach my back with my other loofah. Afterwards, I went in with my Clinique acne bar and I used this on my body, um, specifically my shoulders and my back because I have blemishes there and people think they're freckles i don't know This is me cleaning my legs, of course, obviously, with the Dove soap. Yeah, 
Don't forget your feet. I went and rinsed that off and then after I went in with my coconut lime tree hut sugar scrub. I love the way this feels on my skin. I love that it actually exfoliates me and it's abrasive just like I said in my last video. Rinse that off and I took my rag and my Dove Sensitive Skin Bar Soap and I went and washed my body over again. In the next clip you'll actually see that it doesn't suds up as much as a loofah does. The last thing I used for my entire body is the Dove Body Polish, Pomegranate Seeds and Shea Butter and I love this scent. Not only that, but I love the way this polish feels against my skin. It feels so soft and so smooth and the scent lingers for a little bit after I get out of the shower. Okay, last but not least, no, I did not forget my girl down there. I used my Sensitive Skin Bar Soap from Dove, and I used my Kojic Acid Hyperpigmentation Fading Bar, and I just, I love the way these two work together. My girl feels clean while also lightening herself, like, please, okay? It can't get any better than this. So this is my skin after I washed everything off, well, rinsed everything off, and as you can see, it's looking glowy, um, in my opinion. And when I get out the shower, I moisturize my skin, of course, I put on clothes, and then I get my black self in the bed. The end. And that is the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe to see more from me. Follow on my socials, linked down below. We are on the road to 200 subscribers. I know we can do it. So help me out here, guys. And yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video.